Uh, I don't even have a big head. I can't go bald. I don't have the head to go bald. Oh, this is pretty. Oh, this looks like one of those wigs from Halloween. It looks so weird. <laughs> Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. For today's video I'm testing out some wigs that I purchased from AliExpress. Now if you guys don't know what AliExpress is, it is a website that is sort of like Wish but everything is from China and everything is pretty affordable as well. So I have never tried on a proper wig before in my life. The last time that I wore a wig was probably when I was younger and it was Halloween and I dressed up as a witch or something like that but that was the last time that I actually wore a wig and I actually had to speak to my friend Emma because she has so many wigs and she wears them all all the time throughout winter she just says basically if you're going out what's the point in doing your hair you can just throw on a wig and then it will just look really good so i let her know that i was buying a couple of wigs and she was actually really excited for me so these are completely different styles to what my hair is now i wanted to test out some wigs that were completely different hairstyles different hair colors because i really want to see what i look like and i've seen so many people on instagram that wear wigs and they look so natural and so nice so these ones that i got they are lace front because apparently those ones look more natural and I am so excited to test them out. So I did actually have a look at some videos on how to put on lace front wigs. So I feel like I am a little bit clued up. Now I don't have the glue that goes around the top of my head, but we're gonna try them on and see how they go anyway. So if you're new to my channel and you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below and also make sure you hit the bell icon just so you're notified every time I upload a new video. So the wigs that I purchased are synthetic just because if you get real hair wigs, they are pretty expensive and these ones are pretty affordable. Now they did look really good on the photos. I did also look at some of the reviews and people did put photos of them wearing the wigs and it actually looks pretty good. So I do have higher hopes for these than what I would if I purchased them on Wish that did have any reviews so these ones look like they might be pretty good but you never know what they're like until you get them because you can look at a photo and it can look absolutely amazing and you get it in real life and it can look really really bad and I've had that with a couple of things that I've purchased from China before where it looks really good in the photos and then you try it on and it just does not look good so if I don't put the wigs on properly or perfectly please don't come at me like I said to you guys I have never worn a lace front wig before all I've worn are costume ones that you wear when it's Halloween but I do have a couple of wigs and I haven't actually opened them at the moment they're just in the packaging so I do have one in this packaging right here I also have another one in this packaging so I haven't opened them I don't actually know what they're gonna look like I don't know if they're gonna come with the wig cap I'm not sure if some of these are gonna have the drawstring or if they're gonna have the clip so this is gonna be a complete first impression on any wig that I've tried and we'll see how it looks and see how it goes and I will also put down in the screen right here what it looks like on their website and I'm gonna let you know the price of these and then also which style I got as well so the first wig that I'm gonna try is the one that's in this bag here and it looks quite flat so this is what it looks like so it does come in a packet just like this and then I'm assuming this is a wig cap it looks like one of those socks you know one of those tight socks tootsies so I'm assuming that this is the cap this one is in the shade 1b and it does have a net in there as well and I do like the fact that it's come in this bag because you can just put it in the bag afterwards a lot of people have said that if you do buy some wigs then you should get the mannequin heads as well I don't have them so yeah so I think my friend probably has them she has so many wigs and they look so good and the good thing about this is that if I don't like these I'll just turn around to my friend Emma and say do you want these wigs and I'll probably end up giving them to her so she's probably really excited that I'm testing these out because she might end up getting two wigs so this is what the wig looks like so it is a long bob one and the reason why I got this is because it's completely different to my natural hair color and you do also on the front have the little strands right there so it does look a little less put together so it looks a little bit more like it's natural hair so it's a hairline and then on the inside it has a clip at the back right here and then it's got a couple of clips around the side as well so you can see that it is a little bit more see-through so you can get a little bit more of your scalp I am a little bit worried because as you guys can see I have ginger hair and I'm worried that I'm gonna end up having ginger hair that's gonna be coming out of here and it's not gonna look natural and it's gonna look really weird but We'll try it on and see how it goes. So I do have a hair tie. And I think I'm just going to put my hair in like a low bun. And I'm going to take out the wig cap. And this is something that is going to look hilarious. I've seen people put these on before and they just laugh at themselves. And I feel like I am probably going to laugh at myself wearing this. So yeah, it just looks like a sock. So we're going to put it on. It even looks like a sock. It's not massive. Look at that. So... I 
I don't even have a big head. Oh, just about got it on. Just took all of my hairs in. <laughs> I literally look like an egg. <laughs> I can't go bald. I don't have the head to go bald. So many people have really beautiful heads when they go bald and they look so nice. Me? No, it just wouldn't work for me. I have a weird shaped head even when I haven't got a wig cap on. <laughs> I need to take a photo. So the lace actually doesn't look too bad. It doesn't look too big at all. It actually looks quite short, which is good. So I'm just going to cut a little bit around it so this wig that i have is called the fashion idol 10 inch lace front wig straight bob hair wigs for women cosplay wig heat resistant synthetic hair free shipping so this is supposed to be heat resistant but i think with all of these synthetic ones they are only heat resistant up to a certain temperature and i do have ghds and those you can't change temperature on them i have not had a black bob before in my life so we're gonna just sort of push this here Ugh, this looks like one of those wigs from Halloween. I look like Morticia Adams. <laughs> okay, so. Ugh. This is so strange. I've never worn a wig before. Okay. My head is not even big and it feels like that this is quite small for my head. Ugh, this looks bad. <laughs> so it's got to be a centre parting. Okay, I feel like I look like that girl from Sia's music video, but with dark hair. This doesn't look right on me. I don't know if I've just got a really weird hairline or that it's so far back, but I feel like this doesn't look right. If I look on someone else, this would look really good. Even on the photos from the customer ones, it looks really nice. And I don't know. I don't know if I like it. It looks so weird. Let's just have a look at another mirror and let's see what it looks like. So the cut looks pretty good. It's molting a little bit. I feel like that looks really good. However, I think that the hairline just looks so strange. You know what? I'm actually starting to like this wig. I actually pretty enjoy it. Let me zoom out. So this is what the wig looks like and I actually really enjoy the way that it looks. I like the length of it. I like the colour of it. It's so weird to see me with dark hair because I haven't had dark hair in like four years. If you have been subscribed to me for a while, you'll know that I had long, pretty much black hair and it was so pretty. I loved it. However, I need to style my hair a lot. But this is really nice, actually. I like this. And yeah, I think it's really nice. So I'm liking this wig. I'll have to take a photo of me in it and send it to Neil and see what he thinks. Do you like it? It's a wig. It's weird, isn't it? No, it's like Kim Kardashian. Is it? I don't know. Do you like it? Sure. So we just FaceTime Neil and I don't know if he likes it or not, but I actually like this now. I feel like it looks a lot better now that I've actually like put it on a little bit better than it was before. I wish that I got the one that was a bit shorter because I do have a shorter one on the website, but it was out of stock. This one cost me £18.82. It's 14 inches, density is 130, lace front and the colour is 1B. So yeah, I like this and pretty happy with it. And the other one that I have is in this packaging right here and... I, again, haven't opened it, so we will see what it looks like. Oh, this is pretty. So this one is like an ombre one, so it does have the rooted top up there, and then it's also blonde at the bottom. So they did have two different colours on the site, and that one started off as 1B at the top, and then it was blonde at the bottom, but I just felt like it didn't really look that natural if you were to get one of these wigs. But this looks so nice. This looks huge. So this one I got in 20 inches. And it looks really, really long. And on the website, it's called Rong Jui Long Silk Straight Synthetic Lace Front Wig High Temperature Ombre Blonde Lace Wigs for Women Two Tone Blonded Wig. And this one I got in 20 inches, 40 mixed blonde, and it was £25. So not super expensive. Pretty good, actually, to be honest. But we'll see how it looks. So on the photos... This girl has a half up, half down hairdo. Obviously, it's not the wig and it's the girl's actual natural hair. But when I was looking at the reviews on this and people had put in all of their photos and things like that, it looked like it was pretty good. So I'm hoping this one is going to be good. So this is what this one looks like. So it does have the roots on here and then it's blonde and it looks really pretty. It feels really nice as well. It doesn't 
feel that synthetic it feels pretty soft but obviously with synthetic wigs they do tend to tangle a lot of hair exactly the same if you have synthetic hair extensions i remember when i had synthetic hair extensions this was when clipping hair extensions first came out like i don't know it must have been about 15 or something and they came out and i had these synthetic ones that cost like 10 pounds and at the bottom they were so matted oh it was not a good look it looked really really bad like horrendous but this looks like it's probably not going to do that at the moment so this one has the lace front again at the front and then this is what the parting looks like so the parting is pretty see-through which is good because then it looks a little bit more natural this one also comes with another wig cap so this one has three clips and you've got one at the top and then you've got two at the sides i can't tell if i like this one i just don't know i feel like that it needs a little bit of styling I like my centre parting, so I don't know whether to put it as a side part in. It's not that bad, you know. The colour actually looks really nice. The colour looks like a very natural blonde. Some people have had ones where they look bright yellow. This one looks like an ash blonde. This looks pretty nice. I actually like this, I think. So it goes all the way down to here. And this is the 20 inch ones. I think I like it. Let's see what Neil thinks. What do you think? That's weird. It looks very flat on top. I know. Where's your... How have you hidden your hair? I sent you a picture. I'm wearing a ball cap. How are you? What do you think? I think it's clear at the top. No, it's cl clear that it's not real. So, as you guys heard from Neil, he thinks it's weird obviously it is weird i have a completely different hair color and like you mentioned as well it is quite flat at the top and that is something that i noticed so you might just need to like zhuzh it up at the top but i did take some photos and in the photos it looks really good and i did send some to my friends and they said that it looks really nice so i like it i feel like it looks pretty good like it doesn't look like natural hair like completely it is obviously shiny but i feel like it is pretty high quality for synthetic hair and also the fact that you can use a little bit of heat on it as well is pretty good but i like it a lot the um, it's so strange to see me with this hair colour so yeah obviously the hairline I do need to sort out this wig properly need to put it on properly and things like that but I like it I feel like it looks pretty good and it makes me want to go blonde so that was pretty fun testing out some wigs and now I'm back to my natural hair and it doesn't look strange anymore so overall i actually feel like that the quality of the wigs was pretty good for the price the blonde one i did really like i felt like that it looked really nice and it looked pretty natural as well so that was something that i did really like about it obviously i would just need to put it on a little bit better because the hairlines just didn't look that good on me but like i mentioned i haven't worn a lace front wig before so that's obviously why it's gonna look a little bit weird but i do really like the blonde one i feel like that it's really nice and thick and it's really long and it looks really good and i really like the colors of it as well so it doesn't look super fake now you can see that it is a little bit more shiny than a human hair wig but it still looks pretty nice now with this black one it was very different for me so this one was cheaper than the blonde one and it does feel like better quality than what I paid for it. It is pretty good. So I do like the fact that it has a pretty good hairline on there as well. But something that I don't like is the fact that this has a hole. It has a hole in it. So that's not too bad because to be honest, I can just get some thread and I can just sew that up. But the other one doesn't have that. I do like the fact that it has the clips on here and the fact that it's lace front. I think that's pretty good. But if you can see it's not actually that thick and just by me putting my hand here you can see that it's not really that thick you can see some of my fingers coming through right there i'm not too sure if you can see so it's not super thick but it is thicker than i thought it would be and the hairline is pretty good the thing is the cut the cut is not that good so when i put it on it didn't look that bad but as you can see here the cut is very very jagged i was looking in another mirror which is out here it's a full length mirror and i do need to cut it so the cut isn't really the best as you can see but when i was wearing this wig i really felt like edna mode from the incredibles which was so funny and 
After I went downstairs and showed Neil, I was like, I look like I'm a Bond girl and I'm wearing one of these wigs and I look like that I can kick ass. And that's exactly how I felt wearing it. So I feel like it is good if you do want to have something for a costume or anything like that. I don't feel like this one looks pretty natural. I feel like the, it might do if I cut it a little bit. I might get my mum to cut it a little bit shorter and even it up a little bit as well just to see how it goes. But it isn't too bad for the price. It's pretty good for the price. It just doesn't look super natural, but obviously I will have to style it and sort of see how it goes but I do feel like that the blonde one looks so much more natural looks so good for £25 you can't go wrong with this wig it actually looks better than some of the wigs that I've seen that people have put reviews on on some other websites so this was really good and I do definitely recommend the blonde one this one not sure I will obviously have to see how I style it I actually thought that this would be like one of those wish videos where people have picked up some really beautiful full thick wigs and then they put them on and they look nothing like the photos so these ones looked close to the photos they didn't look exactly the same and to be honest for 25 pounds you can't get a wig that's going to look completely natural but i feel like these ones did pretty well and i am actually pretty impressed in how they are so those are the two wigs that i purchased from aliexpress and overall i think that they are pretty good for the price and like i mentioned i do recommend the blonde one black one not really too sure of so if you want me to do any more of these videos or if you want me to do any wish videos then just comment down below to let me know and i hope that you enjoyed this video and make sure they give it a very big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and i'll I will see you in my next video, guys. Bye.